Welcome to Sherwood Forest. Oh, wait, that's not right. That's not it either. Nope. Oh, wait, that's right. We're not at Sherwood Forest. We're at... Mulkity is back and we're ready to steal the show! More than 850 talented Catholic school students from across North Queensland have arrived at the Townsville Entertainment and Convention Centre this morning to kick off the 2023 Mulkity Youth Arts Festival. Mulkity is a unique learning experience, providing students and staff who have a passion for the arts to come together to collaborate, develop skills and create unforgettable experiences. The week-long program will involve intensive workshops led by local industry professionals. In the disciplines of choir, led by Rachel Cairns, dance, led by Jane Pirani, drama, led by Armina Fleming and Theatre Inc., strings, conducted by Stephen Fruin-Lord, guitar, led by Andrew Vivas, band, conducted by Rianta Belford, and audio-visual media, spearheaded by Kevin Whelan and Luke Taylor. I'm here with the Artistic Director of Mulcahy, Sandra Neal. Sandra, can you tell me what people can expect from Friday's sold-out performance? Ah, people can expect an amazing show filled that with 850 children that has been specifically written. We have dance, we have drama, we have choir, band, guitar, strings and an incredible AV media team working on this great show. Mulgady gives the students here from Townsville Diocese, which goes all from Palm Island down to uh, Proserpine and all the way out to the schools in between with Mount Isa. And that gives them an opportunity to come together and work with specialists who are renowned in their field to uh, upskill and, and grow in their areas of performing arts. Who's excited for Mulcahy? Me! So boys, what's the most memorable thing about Mulcahy? Connecting with students and teachers. Uh, the long lasting friends and the great experience. Definitely the awesome show that we put. I'm excited to catch up with some old friends from previous Mulcahy's and to just see how things turn out this year. Can't wait. We're straight into our action-packed workshops and today we are checking in with choir led by the renowned Rachel Cairns. Hi, I'm Rachel Cairns and I conduct the Mulcahy Choir. I'm so excited for Mulcahy this year. We always have a sea of new faces, old faces, students who have been in Mulcahy since grade five and who are now in grade 11 and ready to say goodbye. I'm passionate about teaching kids to sing. I'm passionate about conducting choirs and I want so many people to experience that and I'm just so thrilled that they keep asking me back year after year to work with these wonderful young people to help them do just that. I think sometimes being a regional town, we get uh, labelled with a very very unfair image of being uh, not as good as our, our southern counterparts and in fact I think sometimes we are just as good if not better we bring together so many of our students from all over our diocese and it's been really lovely for me to have gone and visited Concurry and Mount Isa and Hewenden and Winton and all of these places to, to visit our students who wouldn't normally even have a chance to sing in a choir or dance in a group or play in a band and then now all of a sudden they're here they're doing it and they're like fish to water and it's a it's a lovely thing to witness. What's it like working with Rachel? Um, it's fun and entertaining. It's fun and she's like really nice so. Um, yeah she's fun and also very energetic. She's always making it fun in any way possible. Exciting. Quite confusing. We've been learning a lot of funky and cool songs like Larger Than Life and Don't Stop Me Now. Yeah she's really nice and she like she has like great vocal warm-ups. That's a wrap on day one of Mulcahy Youth Arts Festival for 2023. Follow us throughout the week on Facebook and Instagram with the hashtag Mulcahy23. Join us on this epic adventure as we steal hearts with our performance, not gold. Come back tomorrow for a sneak peek as our drama and band students hit their targets.